What's up? Good morning, guys. Welcome back to another video. Uh, I know it's been a long time, but I told you new videos are coming back this year. So, as you guys can see, we got a pretty rad sunrise behind us. It is currently about 6.30 a.m. on a Tuesday. Uh, before work, we we're in just some random business park. Got the car set up. This video, uh, I'm gonna be going over how to take pictures and edit them on your iPhone and uh, post them. It's pretty simple, uh, but I get asked quite a bit on how I do it, how I edit them. So this video is gonna be all about how we're editing our videos and photos. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. All right, guys, first up, it's all about finding a decent backdrop on a good road. As you guys can see, this seems to work pretty good. This currently is in the cinematic mode on my camera on the new iPhone. So it adds in the fuzziness where you want it. So you just slightly move around and focus on the car the entire time. And then this is shot in normal video. As you can see, everything is crisp and clear. The backdrop, everything is crisp and clear. The other mode tends to blur it out in the background a bit if you're trying to hide where you're at or make it seem a little more realistic. All right, so right here I'm using an app called PS Express. This is one of the apps that I use to edit my pictures if I don't really have the time um, to mess with it the way I'm gonna show you next. Um, but basically there's just preset options that I'm scrolling through showing you guys. And then you just hit save, or if it's one of the ones that it wants you to purchase the app, I always just screenshot it and then there you go, you have the picture. So, all right, that's that app. The next section here coming up is uh, how to edit a picture on your actual iPhone. So I go through the settings to use um, on your iPhone to edit the picture. Just follow those numbers and you should end up with a very similar result to what is posted. Okay, and then this last app that I'm showing you here is Superimpose X. And I use this to add logos of any sort to your picture before posting it. So as you can see here, real quick, just threw on a logo and uh, that way you can see what it looks like when it's done. As always guys, thanks for tuning in. And uh, if there's any other tips or tricks videos you guys would like to learn, uh, put them in the comments below. I'm going to be reading them. That way I can give you guys the videos you're looking to see. Thanks, and catch you on the next one.